Hello again, it's Steve Grizzetti, co-founder of MoviePicks.com and author of the MoviePicks.com Guide to Vegas Movie Studio. And here we are in Movie Studio exploring the new uh, multi-cam feature that's been added in version 14. Now what we did in part one of this series is that we took the media, we added it to our timeline, we synchronized the audio and video tracks, so three were all lined up. Then we went to the tools menu to multi-camera. We created a multi-camera track from our four separate video sources and we also enabled multi-cam editing and that's what you see right now where we see all four video sources represented on the screen. Now the one that's live or the one that will be the one that the audience sees is the one that's highlighted in blue. Now all we've got to do to create a cut from this multi-camera video is just play the video and cut from source to source. And all I need to do is just click on that particular source on the monitor. Let me show you what I mean. Let's start the playback of the movie. And as I'm watching it and listening to it, I am cutting from source to source simply by clicking on the different camera angles. That's it. Now, that may seem to be a lot of pressure on you to make decisions right on the fly. What if I make a mistake? Does that mess up my entire cut? And it does not, because the beauty of multi-camera editing is that it's continually re-editable. In other words, you can make adjustments and changes to it. So anyway, once we've done this with our entire half hour or hour video, whatever it is that we've cut, we can stop the playback and we can confirm our cuts or adjust our cuts. So I'm just gonna put the playhead back here on the timeline to right before we started cutting. And then I'm gonna press the up arrow, get a little bit of a close up on the timeline. Now what has essentially happened here is that the program has cut the event into little pieces and then simply selected different takes for each event. So our event there represents four takes. If I right click on one of these cuts, you can see if I select take, it's using camcorder four. We go over to this cut here. If I right click, it's using camcorder two. And that's how the program creates these cuts. Now I'm going to turn off the multi-cam view here on the preview window, just by going to the tools menu, going to multi-camera and unchecking enable multi-camera editing. So now we're only seeing the video that we selected with each cut and I can play that and sort of proof it. Is this the cut I really want? Now, in some cases, uh, I cut at a bad time. So for instance, look at that. There is a cut in which there is uh, movement. I generally don't want uh, an adjustment in the camera's position show up in my cut. So what I'm going to do is go back to this cut and swap in a different cut. So to replace the cut, all I have to do is right click on that particular segment, go to take and select a different camera angle. There we go. Now I wanna show you one more thing. What if I cut too soon? What if I cut too late? Uh, can I make those adjustments also? And yes, you can. You can slip and slide these takes. To do that, you hold down the control and the alt key on your keyboard. Notice how the mouse changes there to sort of the trim adjacent mode and that will slip and slide. There we go, the cut. Now see what I've done? This makes the cut a little sooner. This makes it later. It doesn't change the length of anything. It doesn't upset the synchronization. It simply moves the cut. And so I can get exactly the multicam cut I want. And that's how easy it is, folks. The multicam editor, brand new in version 14, I think it's a great addition. It's been a part of the professional version of Vegas for several generations. And boy, a really great addition here in Studio 14. Now, if you want to know more about this program, be sure to check out all the tips and tutorials we have at moviepix.com. If you want to know everything about the program, as well as DVD Architect, be sure to check out our moviepix.com guides for both Movie Studio Platinum and DVD Architect. They are available at amazon.com. And of course, right here at the Movie Pick store. I'm Steve Grisetti. Thanks for joining me. Hope to see you again real soon.